Water holes in the heart. Atrial septal defect. An atrial septal defect, or ASD, is a hole in the wall that separates the upper collecting chambers. Atrial is a name we give to the upper chambers of the heart. Septal is a medical term for wall, and defect is a gap. Taken together, it means that there is a gap in the wall of the upper portion of the heart. If the hole allows a significant amount of blood across from the left heart to the right heart, over time, the right heart will increase in size and work harder. Over time, this can cause the heart and lungs to work harder and put the child at risk for other conditions as an adult. These include abnormal cardiac rhythms and heart muscle failure. In some ASDs, the hole can become smaller and even close on their own over time. However, if the hole remains significant in size, it needs to be closed. Each ASD is assessed individually to ascertain the most appropriate management and closure option. What are holes in the heart? Ventricular septal defect. A ventricular septal defect, or VSD, is a hole or communication in the wall that separates the lower right and left heart pumping chambers, or ventricles. It is the most common type of congenital heart condition which is present from birth. For many ventricular communications, the natural history is for them to become smaller on their own or even close spontaneously over time. Often, observation or medical therapy, including higher calorie formula or medications to relieve congested breathing, are all that is needed. If the hole is large enough, this allows a significant amount of blood across the hole and some infants develop difficulty with growth and breathing. If an infant has significant difficulties with growth or breathing, despite medical therapy, then surgical closure can be performed with excellent results. In some instances, the defect can be closed by a catheter or keyhole-based procedure. The need for surgical or catheter closure is based on the type and size of the defect, as well as clinical symptoms seen in the baby or the child.